Now you might think this is somewhat odd and I think that Adrian thinks this is very odd about me but I certainly find singing hymns, choruses, even very traditional hymns, very much a prayer. And I think Adrian had his probably his first qualms about wondering whether he had made the right decision in proposing to this woman when we were uh, visiting York Minster as tourists. And I said, oh, please, please, can we go to Evensong? Evensong was never Adrian's favourite service. And we found ourselves not at any just old, quiet Evensong on a, on a weekday, um, but on an Evensong at which old choristers had been invited back. So it was a very big Evensong. And uh, we were crammed into some pew in the, in the side of the, uh, the choir stalls. Uh, and there was uh, what I thought was a wonderfully rousing hymn. Uh, and me being, with wonderful words and a wonderful tune, it was a really good hymn of praise. And me being um, a young, cheerful, charismatic, uh, lifted my hands uh, and sang praise to God through the words of the hymn with poor Adrian being really embarrassed uh, as an Englishman would be uh, beside me because I find singing hymns uh, and choruses to God a really prayerful activity. I take the words and bind uh, the words of the hymns and the choruses to my heart and I sing them as a prayer. I make the words my own. So I find singing a very prayerful activity uh, and sometimes I pray them, I sing them on my own um, as well. Uh, and have done uh, since I was young. So don't be afraid uh, to sing the words of your prayers, to sing the choruses that you like. And these days, of course, um, we can do it with headphones and with um, with our phones and YouTube and all sorts of things. Uh, and thank you for the people that do send me uh, clips of, of lovely worship songs uh, that they, they're encouraged by and they hope that I might be encouraged by them because I am. It's lovely uh, to hear the worship songs, so thank you. So do do enjoy those. If you haven't um, sampled those sorts of things, worship songs uh, and even old-fashioned hymns, for those of you who haven't tried those, some of those are very, very moving and very uh, uplifting. Singing or listening to worship songs can be really, really prayerful as we're carried along uh, by the words or by the music. Uh, and if that hasn't been your thing, uh, make it. It's not just a thing we do in worship. At this point, we sing a hymn. Uh, listen to the words, open yourselves to the music and allow yourself to bind your hearts to them and make it a prayer, not just something we do. When this COVID time is over and we can go back into church, then don't make the hymns just a punctuated part of the service. Make those words something you direct to God.